world of education was somebody would stand, be boring, low energy, and lecture at you for five hours. You want to shoot yourself in the face. It's called stand and lecture. That's the education paradigm that's ruled society for a long time. And it's absolutely off and it's disgusting. There's a lot of aspects how Tony is changing education. I think he's a shining example of what in-person education should be like. Now, as you know, I'm not here to change in-person education. That's not my goal. My goal is to change online education. I'm an online guy. I'm not running physical businesses. I'm into running online businesses. The point is how he's doing it is attracting tons of people to pay five to $10,000 for a week, one week of education willingly. And it's not even education which teaches you about business. It's not even education that teaches you about making money. It's not education that teaches you that has any necessarily material payoff. It's working on yourself. And he's bringing in, whatever, $25 million from one event. It's because people want to learn in an engaged way. People want community. College does not necessarily encourage community. Fraternities do, sororities do. College does not. College encourages you to get an A, an A. Lots of people, how many people here went through the experience where they drive to college, community college, drive home every day? It doesn't encourage community, it's not about that. Another thing about what Tony Tony's education is that he's forcing people to involve their bodies. All that, they got all the dancers on stage. They said, all the dancers come on stage and all the music started blaring. It's craziness in there, man. So they really get people to involve their body to lock things down. One of the biggest problems with a lot of my students, I teach people how to start online business. Blogging or blogging is sensible. I teach people how to be an online entrepreneur. The biggest problem with my students is they over-intellectualize everything. Everything. They're in their head. Paralysis by analysis. That's all my students. They're thinking too much instead of being in their heart. They're in their mind. And their mind is here, it's here, it's here. One month it's it's uh, drop shipping with Shopify. Another month, it's Amazon selling. You know, that's the best business trade is in the Amazon business. The next month, it's investing in Bitcoin. The next month, it's not investing in Bitcoin, it's investing in other cryptocurrencies. And then the next month, it's not investing in other cryptocurrencies, it's launching an ICO. How many people here understand what I'm talking about? And if you're in your head, you're gonna be floating around up there, you're never gonna be moving forward with anything, you're gonna be poor, your wife's gonna leave, you're gonna die, bro, and your kids are gonna age. No, not really. But that's a possibility. For sure. We need to get out of our heads and Tony does a very good job with his education of getting people into their body, getting people into their heart, your physiology and your emotional state. Physiology is moving around, emotional state is your heart. That's one area where traditional education doesn't really address. I'm talking about the education system. I think everybody here hates it. Another way that Tony really is changing education I would say is this based around experience. He really makes it experiential. And that's part of, you know, the physiology and all that other stuff. But when you make education an experience rather than just somewhere you go and you sit down and you just listen for a few hours every day, he turns it into something fun. He turns it into something I did that. Yesterday, Usher got on stage, was like, whoa, we had that thing where Usher got on stage or something like that. It turns into a fun experience and see, you know, the community, all that stuff. And you see it, you know, I've had a couple people come up to me and it's almost a sense of identity too. That's what a lot of the universities, a lot of the colleges, you know, Central Michigan University, does that have a true identity or people just commuting in and commuting out? So you really got to think about how to change it because you rock by the way. Go into it, work on it. There's some crazy things that happen here. I encourage you guys, if you guys are looking into changing education or a new sort of educational experience, check out one of these events. If you can't make it to an event, check out my training. I do monthly trainings. I want to spark a discussion here, you know, check out some of my articles in Forbes or BuzzFeed or whatever about how to change education because it's not coming from the government. It's not coming from the educational institutions. It's not coming from any of those areas. It has to come from the people. It has to come from the people actually putting their mouth or putting their wallet or whatever to where the best teachers are training people in new things. It's not coming from the University of Central Michigan. The University of Central Michigan is not changing. The University of Central Michigan is always gonna be the same. So you can't expect the institutions to change. You have to change it yourself by demanding 
better educational programs. Teachers like me, I'm devoted to you guys, teachers like Tony, etc. So have fun. If you guys are interested in hearing a little bit more about my thoughts on education, check out some of the links in the description. I have started a company. I've been meeting with venture capital firms for a few months now. I'm raising a big round of funding for my company, We Learn, which is focused on changing the whole face of education. This has become, I'd say, my mission to change in the world. As much as I love teaching people to be entrepreneurs and blogging and blogging, I believe we have way further to go. I believe this is a massive thing. Everybody, everybody needs to get on board a new system of education. So talk about it in the discussion. Let me know what your thoughts are, how the education system needs to change. If anybody's interested in my vision for what that actually looks like, not just the problems with the current education system, you can see some of it here in person, obviously online. I think it's different. Um, check out the articles. Let me know in the comments. What is your vision? What problems do you have with the current educational system? Or what do you think an education system in the future looks like? Should be free or the teachers should be not bored or every teacher should be a YouTube celebrity or every teacher should have published a book or um, there should be no teachers and it should be all group. Whatever it is, I want to hear it. Talk with you guys soon. Let me know in the comments. Let's change the fucking world. You're going to see a lot more videos about me on education. I love this stuff. Let's do it. Let's do it together. Subscribe. Share this video. Share with your friends. Check me out. Head back in. Off my break again. I uh, love you guys. Uh, but within the first uh, few exercises, I did the exercises immediately and I got immediate sales and I just couldn't believe it. No money has to come out of your pocket for ad spend or nothing. He shows you the true and legit way to start your marketing campaigns with no money. I've been with John's program for a few years now. Uh, I remember when I first started out, uh, making my first like $100 was a big deal. Uh, but, you know, I've stuck with John's program and, you know, changed my life completely. Uh, able to, you know, afford a mortgage uh, and just live the lifestyle that I want right here in Vegas.